Welcome to South Platte Renew, the third largest wastewater treatment facility in the state, servicing 300,000 people in the southwest suburban Denver metro. Peter Van Rye is director here. Since March of 2020, he and his team have seen renewed interest in wastewater epidemiology. The loading at the wastewater generally is a little bit of a leading indicator than, than what's actually being reported. And that's been seen across the country. But lately, COVID-19 data is showing something unusual here. The highest spikes of the virus found in southwest metro wastewater since the pandemic began. What we're seeing right now is the trend is actually heading up. As seen on this graph with the dark blue line, there are peaks followed by valleys of the virus in wastewater. These measurements far surpass case counts seen in green. That tall peak showing more than a million copies of the virus per liter of wastewater. And that's happening despite a recent dip in confirmed cases in Colorado. Researchers suspect they're seeing more of the virus in wastewater from those who are vaccinated who may never know they contracted the virus. That's entirely a possibility that people aren't realizing that they have symptoms, yet they're still shedding the virus. Twice a week, the samples are taken from here, the rawest of raw sewage. It is a smelly job. They look for the, the DNA signature of the virus. Van Rye says don't get too caught up in the recent spikes just yet. It's important to determine a trend, and that requires more time. You can't really look at it from a week to week perspective. We look at it as a month to month or now year over year trend. 